Over 7,000 stories lay in this garden. He was a, a really ambitious uh, a guy, a good runner. But only one. One of the stories, he did a lot of running. Had a journey like this. And he was a runner in the, uh, in the army, taking a message, that's when he got killed. One of four brothers from Ashland, U.S. Army Private First Class Dale W. Ross went missing in 1943 after fighting in the Solomon Islands. 76 years later, his family finally received the words they had been waiting for. It was very hard to believe to start with. Uh, it took a while for me to uh, accept that it wasn't a hoax. After so long... It's got to be amazing to have him home. Dale W. Ross's remains were found by a child on Guadalcanal. Once one of nearly 73,000 currently missing, Ross finally came home to rest in the family plot. We happen to have uh, extra spaces here, and he's, he's with his other brothers and his mother. A remarkable story for one family. It's just really good that he's finally back in Oregon and back with his family where he belongs. But a reminder that others may not get that chance. We're lucky to have this MIA status removed, but there are thousands, tens of thousands of families that won't get this. So, uh, you know, we need to kind of honor them too. In a garden with 7,000 stories, this one stands out as a sign of hope for those still waiting to come home. In Medford, Miles Wodowici, NBC5 News.